Hello, friends. Welcome back for another two episodes of Hunter Hunter. Last week, we watched episodes two and three. Today, we're going to be watching episodes four and five. Uh, we had the three musketeers show up at the trial um, to become hunters, and uh, they met uh, a bunch of other people also undergoing the same trial. Some of them were a little sus. Uh, some of them were kind of cool looking as well. But there was one in particular who looked and sounded suspiciously like our main character, Gone. So not entirely sure what's happening there uh, or if that was intentional or not, but I guess we will find out. And so at the end of the last episode, we had uh, the trial start. So they're doing some kind of like endurance test. They have to keep up with the with the examiner. So... Yeah, that's uh, that pretty much sums up our last episode, and I'm assuming the next couple episodes will be all trial stuff. I don't know how long <laughs> these trial things last or, or what, but uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing how this goes. So without further ado, let's hop in. Episodes four and five today of Hunter Hunter. Let's get it. I am Satotes, your examiner for the first phase of- Satotes. And the applicants have traveled more than 30 kilometers from the starting line. It is a monotonous course with no end in sight, and applicants have already started to drop out. That does sound pretty awful. <laughs> Extrapolating from historical data, it's safe to assume this will be a 40 kilometer course. And if my calculations are correct, we should be nearing the end. That's really far. <laughs> hey. How old are you? Twelve years old. Hmm. Same as me. Uh huh. Oh. I think I'll run for a little while. Uh. Uh. Think someone like you's got what it takes to pass the hunter exam? Uh. Don't ever come back, loser. Uh. So mean. I've really got to hand it to you. You sure do love crushing rookies, don't you, Tompa? <laughs> it's the only reason I get out of bed in the morning. It's a pretty sad life. It's been about four hours since the first phase began, and we've run at least 60 kilometers. Is that even possible? Hey, forget about her. You gotta keep moving. He's not gonna. Then screw this! I'm becoming a hunter no matter what! Got it! Can I try that later? <laughs> sure, if I can try your skateboard. What if they like finagle the fishing rod and the skateboard and they both hop on and then whip the fishing rod at that guy and then just get pulled? We've reached the 80 kilometer mark. Now, let's pick up the pace a bit, shall we? Why do you want to be a hunter? Is it really just about the money? I mean, sure, your attitude is terrible and you aren't too bright either. <laughs> when our emotions are heightened, the color of our eyes will change, taking on a shade of scarlet. In that state, the color of our eyes is considered one of the seven most beautiful colors in the world. And they command a hefty price on the black market. That's messed up. Even now, I can hear them. The anguished screams of their darkened eyes. I swear on my life that I will capture the phantom troop. How did he get away? Take that back, Leorio! I will not stand here and allow you to insult the Kurta! What? It's the truth, isn't it? If I had money, my friend would still be alive today! <sighs> oh. We get in that backstory this episode. The problem was that the operation cost a fortune. I was naive. I figured I could become a doctor. So I could cure kids with the same disease. Oh, that's why he's so good at healing. See you at the finish line! Yeah, catch you later, <laughs> old man. Hey, I'm not old! Can't you tell I'm a teenager just like you? <laughs> I never said I wanted to be a hunter. Huh? I just heard the exam was supposed to be really hard. It sounded kind of fun, so here I am. 
What about you? Well, the thing is, my dad's a hunter. So I decided I was going to be a hunter just like him. Maybe same dad, different moms? Oh! Hey, which one of us was fastest? You crossed the finish line simultaneously. Hey, Mr. Santos, is this where a second phase begins? No, it isn't. We have quite a way to go. Oh my god. No more running, at least? Truly bizarre animals, many of which are crafty, voracious creatures who deceive and feast on human prey. If you're deceived, you'll surely die. Oh. Wait for me! Oh, I thought it was gonna close on him. Oh my god. I'll prove it! Look at this! <laughs> This is a man-faced ape from the Millsy wetlands. Well, then that would certainly explain why he doesn't walk like a normal human. That is true. What? That was the card guy for sure. Oh, is that guy? No, that guy. Wait, what? <laughs> I see, I see. Oh, he tossed them at both. Nature can be so brutal. It's hard to watch. I must assume that a number of you were fooled into suspecting my true identity. Oh, well, I, uh... <laughs> <laughs> Still running. So, I'm not a runner. And I'm not, like, super familiar with the distances or anything like that. But... I think like a 10k is a lot, right? So for them to have run, what was it, 60 or 80,000 kilometers? That's impossible. Like that has to be impossible. And then to continue running <laughs> through wetlands, like your body would just stop working at a certain point. And there's no way like 300 and something past that only 30 something couldn't do it there's no way in hell no way um i had a feeling that these trials would span over multiple episodes but i'm glad we got some character backstory there that was very interesting we uh uh we learned a little bit about gone's two companions um and interesting that Killua is there for fun, not to become a hunter. There's gotta, there's gotta be something there. They talked about Gon's dad. I just, I feel like they're either related or there's something happening between those two for sure. Yeah, that was episode four. That was episode four. Episode five, we're going to be continuing phase one of the exam. Uh, so yeah, let's do it. Let's hop in. Episode five of Hunter Hunter. Smell, huh? Huh? I don't think he smells. <laughs> Wait, hold on! I don't like them splitting up. Whoa, what is that? Evil strawberries? Oh, a noggin lugging tortoise. <laughs> I thought it was a dinosaur. Uh huh. Yep. Mushroom landmine? Please make sure to follow close behind me. He's over there! It's a faker! Whatever, these guys were mean anyway. <laughs> yep. <gasps> Be sure to follow close behind me! Oh! Frog in waiting. Ooh, right.
right in the eye. Ow. Okay, but like all four of them lost sight of the examiner. How the hell are they going to make it now? <laughs> I guess he must not have liked the way we tasted, huh? It was this stuff. <laughs> oh, the drink Topa had. <sighs> Forget about him. We need to keep moving. We can still make it if we start right now. How are they supposed to know which way to go? <clears throat> Hold on. Uh, Look over there. Huh? Huh? Interesting. <laughs> I'm getting the impression that this guy is like kind of evil. But I really like him. I don't know if he's going to be an ally or an adversary to the main main characters, but I'm vibing with him. Help me! Help! All right, we caught up with the main group, Gone. Look. That's weird. I also don't... I don't trust any of this. I don't know if he's actually going to attack them. Now run! Hmm. I see. A wise decision. Okay. So, probably not on the same side. <laughs> oh, Gon went after them. Well done. Very nice. I'm beginning to get excited. Who is this guy? It's so delightful. I love that look. Okay, so I'm getting like actual evil vibes now. Maybe I don't like him so much anymore. And that's because he passed. <laughs> what? And yes, you pass as well. Is he the examiner? No. Yes. Can you find your own way back? Good boy. Is he the examiner? Why did they pass? Okay, I don't think he was actually the examiner. Leorio is always wearing this very unique kind of cologne. I can smell him from a few kilometers away, no problem. <gasps> oh my god. Is it Axe body spray? I must admit that I'm impressed by his superhuman agility and the gracefulness of his technique. Why couldn't he be a hunter? I was so scared that all I wanted to do was run away, but I couldn't. Because I was excited at the same time. Isn't that weird? Adrenaline, baby! At this stage, 220 candidates have withdrawn from the exam, and 148 remain. Okay, now we're getting to a more reasonable number, I think. <laughs> okay, that was episode 5. I really enjoyed that episode. And... I think... It's... I think the show is starting to come out with uh, characters and themes that are becoming a little bit more interesting than just, you know, your standard, like, hero. And Hisoka, I think his name is. Really, really interesting character. Again, I'm not sure if he's evil Or, like, maybe more of a gray area, like, more just kind of self-serving. 
but I find him very, very interesting. And I'm curious what he is. Like, he must have magical abilities of some kind. I'm definitely getting the impression that in this world, magic of some sort exists. I haven't really got much of a sense of like how much or how prevalent that magic is, but any world with magic in it is a good world for me. Um, and I love spending time in worlds that have magic, so I'm here for it. We're about to get into probably phase two, it seems like. Uh, and I'm very much looking forward to that. We'll probably meet another examiner. I have a feeling the stakes are going to go up quite a bit. And, uh, you know, I'm getting the impression that this show is going to get much more interesting. I'm now, it took a little while. And I think a lot of that is the pacing. Like, this is definitely a slower paced show compared to the other shows that I've watched so far. I'm definitely sensing this isn't just going to be... Uh, you're kind of like formulaic. This is going to be a little bit more complex than just your standard like formula. If that makes any sense at all. Probably not, but it does in my head and that's what matters. Okay, that was episodes four and five, phase one of the exam. Uh, next week, we are going to be watching episodes six and seven, so stay tuned for that. If you would like early access to my videos, you can join my Patreon. I will put a link to that in the description of this video below. I will also put my link tree in the description of this video as well. And of course, don't forget to hit like on this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you would like to continue watching Hunter x Hunter with me and or other anime, would love to have you. Uh, thank you so much for tuning in this week, folks, and I hope you have a good one.